Can you hear me? Think back. Search your memory for an image of yourself. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Code Vein by Bando Namkai. I uh, really, really looking forward to this one. I did play the demo on the PS4. Oh, it was really, really good. Just quite a bit, and they actually had some alternative dungeons you could run after you played through the initial demo. So get a get a good feel for it. This is Dark Souls and anime. Like you got Dark Souls in my anime, or you got anime in my Dark Souls, and this is lovely. Uh, let's remember our name. What is my name? Phil, what's my name? Oh yeah, we fired him. Uh, Alright. Is that not... Go name? Okay. Yeah, we are playing on PC. I forgot I was for a second though. Okay, so... We'll just... Or did I just not? Can't be the same one, maybe. Or not. I don't know. Weird. Uh, I think we gotta be the fe- I compared both ones, but I do like the female character a little better there. A little more aesthetic. Alright, so we got the basic settings. I'm gonna try to use controller. Rip. Happy vampire, sad vampire. Happy vampire, sad vampire. Alright, get the camera to control here. Yeah, we are using an Xbox One wireless controller. You know, different. Kind of reminds me of the Red De uh, Black Desert Online character creation. Right, let's actually go into advanced settings. Physique, they got a weird one. They don't have a height slider or any other kind of sliders. But basically, just I think everything gets weirder, I guess. We'll max it out there. Alright, skin. It has an insane amount of skin choices. Um, let's go. It seems like. Okay, does that look okay? Alright, and hair, lovely hair choices as well. Does have quite a bit for the character creation, I will give it that. A little bit of sporty hair. I usually spend about an hour doing this, but I'll, I'll try to fur it up for the video. I do like taking my time. Because that's where you're going to have the character the entire time. I did notice on the demo too, there is a little bit of clipping. They did have a day one patch. And so far, about 80% positive reviews on Steam as of uh, launch day, a couple hours after launch day. Uh, I think a couple of the technical issues. I know ultra wide support people weren't happy. Uh, somebody had a controller not detected. My controller has been fine. That's kind of cool here. Uh, this could be a winner. Let's see. Eh. I don't want anything that clips though. That's not bad. I think we had the winner up here. Yep, on the right. Yeah, that's it. Okay. And you can actually change up your hair and highlight your hair highlights as well. Let's. For gingers have no souls. Alright. Go with that. And a little bit of maybe blonde highlight there. Or we could do pink highlight a little bit. Oh, I don't know. Acid. Uh, I don't want red highlights on red highlights. The amount of character creation I'm noticing now is just in uh, a little bit of... But not like too dark, too... Alright. Change proportions as well. Oh no, let's actually just go like... 30%, not a no lot a lot. And hair shine. I 
cannot... Oh, I actually can tell a little bit. Alright, there we go. Scary face. The eye pupil. Really? I can barely tell on that one. Eyebrows. Ah, we'll go with that. Yeah, I've gotten the basics out of the way. Makeup. Face paint. Ah, uh, no, we're okay on that. Accessories, what do we got? These are insane hats. Yeah, there are various clipping issues that just... That kind of bothers me. That's always going to bother me in games. Uh, I don't think we're a hat person. No. I think we have various starter outfits. I think we'll just stick with what we got. Ooh, we can't color these. You can color these as well. Oh, good lord. Uh, blue, no. I would like kind of like our black and red, kind of our channel colors usually. Black to do that, and then maybe red for that. And what is. Oh, just the. You can choose the individual pieces as well. Well, maybe go red on that. Okay, that. Let's go out. Not bad, not bad at all. This is our purifier mask. Um, I think, yeah, there we go. And then our mask frame. I actually like the full neck one there. We'll go with that. Way to go. You can't handle me. Time for a little break. <sighs> <laughs> Not bad. What's the matter? Over there. Way to go. Backing down already? I think six is our winner. Alright. There we go. Not bad. I did enter you, but you're just not... <laughs> All right, confirm. There we go. Lovely jubbly. That's what you look like. Good. Now, we can finally meet. Right, let's run through the tutorial here. Pretty easy stuff, though. We should be able to gloss over it really quickly. All right. Open our blood field code. Card new stamp. That is a fighter blood code, which is excellent for combat. Yeah, actually, we're a void type, so we can actually get many, many different. Uh, uh, Alright, but yeah, you have many, many different ones you can get. Let's attack power up. Give it a try. Yes, that will do. There we go. The effects of a gift will not work unless it is prepared in advance. I forgot something important. You will need special blood to activate gifts. This blood comes from revenants who have forgotten themselves. Yeah, we'll be finding the lost. 
And those are pretty much like a Dark Soul bonfire. Back away, get her stamina back up. And murder. Nicely done, very good. Well done. Ordinarily a revenant has only one blood code, but you are different. The blood code you once held was broken and has vanished. That has left you with infinite possibilities. You have the unique talent to change your blood code. Oh, Alright, so now we do have Ranger. The clipping does bother me a little bit. It's nothing... I did enjoy the demo quite a bit, though. But yeah, just the hair clipping. Alright, so now we have a Ranger. Because we are a Void-type class, which we'll learn later on. Which pretty much we can acquire all these different classes uh, to use as Blood-type. So Ranger. Get that up, and we'll change that to Ranger. But you can't equip different weapon, of course. That blood code is known as Ranger. Oh dear. That weapon seems to be too heavy for you. Rangers are nimble and best at fighting with light weaponry. Try switching to a bayonet. Alright, bayonet weapon. Much better, isn't it? Oh, firing your bayonet requires Icor as well. That and gifts means Icor always sees skin. That is where the blood veil you have equipped comes in. Using your blood veil will let you quickly drain Icor from the lost. In addition, this can increase the amount of Icor you can hold. If you have a chance to drain Icor from a foe, use it. I right, got it. See if we can drain some more. Ah! Gotcha! Lovely. Got that down easy enough. Now we need a caster. Specialized in powerful attack type gifts that can be used from distance. That is what is called the caster blood code. Casters possess powers like magic from a fairy tale. With it, you can use gifts to fire projectiles of blood. Well, that does sound awesome. Acquire inherited gifts. Let's go to caster, and then we can learn blazing roar, and what we use for points in this is called haze. And you once you do die, you will have to. You have a certain amount of time to reacquire the haze that you did drop. Uh, nothing new to Dark Souls, though. Type. You unlock the ability to inherit it. Nice. Different 
And you are down. Lovely. Game does once have you beat it. It does have a new game plus. Uh, so you can actually, I think, you scale up the difficulty even more. Am I the chosen one? I got the feeling it's going to be one of those days. Don't worry. It's okay. I don't remember either. Over there. Right, ugh, better pull myself up. So far on PC we're running fairly well. Looks good. What is uh my only Oh can I not change anything here? It's a little bit of motion blur, that's what was bothering me. Fortunately with that I'm almost half dead, barely able to walk. Oh, I'm so tired. We can go slowly. I am here with you. Could you carry me at this point? Just a bit farther. Okay, we'll make it. We're all right. A spring will slake our thirst. If you say so, crazy lady. It seems everyone, everywhere, is thirsty. There is a spring that will cure that thirst. One that weeps tears of blood. Well, all right then. Makes sense. That's what they said, anyway. This way. No, 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 ow, ow. No, no, feel free. Well, alrighty then.
so. It is you. It would seem so. Ooh, shiny. Here. This is for you. Gonna take a nap right over here. Oh, so nice. Well, looks like a we've got a company. And a fresh source of labor. <laughs> we really hit the jackpot. Get up. It's time for a bit of fun. Oh, I'm up. I'm up. All right. Whoa. Keep it down. Your friend just fell asleep. So, what? Oh, it still does the one thing. If I uh, have a conversation and you walk away, like they seriously just. Okay, got it. So be aware if you are starting conversation, you have to sit no there. Fair enough. They're trying to suck a dried blood bead. The view never improves, does it? We came back home after the war against the Queen and found this mist. Getting close to it causes enough pain to drive you mad, so no one has ever crossed it. There's nowhere to go home to, even outside of this prison. All right, burn up and I put on white sleeping. All right, so let's get on our purifier mask. Number three and four, newcomers too. Time to work. Get your gear and come up. All right, we'll go up. It's dry. The miasma's pretty thick. Damn it! We're running out of time before the next collection. Everything's ready. Right. I'm on my way. <laughs> all dried up. Just like the others. Y yeah, all dried up. So there's no sense in searching with the miasma like this. Let's... Ah! You know what these are, right? Blood beads, right? Yes, very good. Now I want you to search for blood beads in the tunnels ahead of here. You see, it's only a short time before the collectors come to take our levy. But once they do, I'm afraid we won't have any blood beads to give them. If we don't find some, Silva's hounds will strip the shirts right off our backs. Well, that's the long and short of it. Why does it have to be us? Don't ask me. The stupid levy system was Silva's idea. If you have a complaint, I suggest you take it up with him. You lot go first. Get to work. Don't. There's a better time and place. For now, we just have to obey. Next! Hello there. You wait here with us. You can have this one back when you return. In exchange for any blood beads you find, of course. 
Right, so we got a hostage situation. Has been showing up around here lately. So make sure you don't all get killed. You heard him. Move it. Ouch. Hey, you okay? It looks like we can't get back up from here. We'll have to look for another way back. Oh, I'm Oliver Collins, by the way. Nice to meet you. All right, so we do have a teammate, Oliver. So it does have some online uh, co-op as well, I believe. I don't know, it's kind of like Dark Souls. We can just call in for uh, somebody for help with a boss fighter and whatnot. We'll have to see here. All right, so let's pull it up. Resting at a missile. It does your hit point does regenerate as well. I can build it uh, level up, get your gifts. But it does bring all the defeated enemies back. So a little worrisome indeed. Alright, I, I think I do want to stick with Warrior. Uh, Warrior did me pretty solid. Sure, I can wait. Hammer the pipe won't be too bad. Alright, let's go. Seen one before. I thought I saw some loot over there. They're not really dead. It's just a dormant state before they turn into real monsters. Or so I've heard. Sometimes it takes years for the transformation to start. So we can just leave them. Or we could kill them now so they don't come back. Any of these you get you can use and you will get a little bit of haze points. All right, oof, Oliver with a nice finish. Yeah, I have been playing a lot of uh, The Surge 2 when that came out, and I do, I highly do anticipate this one will be better. Surge 2, the gameplay was good, but the story never really pulled me. The uh, story Surge series has just never been that great of a page turner. Up and down. Double gets. Well, we'll pile those up for a while. Okay, here we go. Nice. And bash some crates. Up using an upgrading regeneration, so it's a little bit of a heal over time. And you can get those more. Yeah, but I didn't even get hit yet. I think I'm okay. Oof. Okay, I'll ever just straight up clearing this out. Is there something good in there? Got heavy axe. Oh, we can definitely give that a try. I did actually use that all the way uh, through most of the demo. Strength of B dexterities does do a lot of damage. Uh, a lot slower though. Achieving haze. Out of stand of it didn't matter. Most of these guys we can't two hit. Nope. They most definitely are not. Oh, nice job, Oliver. I will just sit back and collect the loot. Book Estates. He's got this. 
Oh, I'm totally helping. Okay, just totally got. Oh. And down. Oh, okay. Well, let's use handy regeneration here. Mildly embarrassing. So you've got a you master to get adrenaline, you master to get triple annihilator, and you master to get health boost. Nice. Is there something good in there? Lost bayonet. We could do want to use another one just yet. No, I think we're okay for now. Open that up. Quinn Iron you used for some crafting and other stuff. Yellow book. Your friend, right? Noodles. Find some blood beads and go back for her quick. All of her seems really too nice for the apocalypse. Oliver, you want to go first, bud? Uh. No? Alright. Wait, which I do think that is used for crafting as well. Okay, sweet Jesus. Those guys aren't much of a trouble other than annoyance. Yep. Easy job. We should be able to purify. So just show a bit of the map. What could that be? Oop, treasure. Good in there? You have to use whatever you can to survive. Alright, so that actually is a veil, blood veil, so is that uh better in some ways. A little bit more crush damage, resistances would be up. That's kind of the old outfit we did have before. Eh, we'll give it a go. Yeah, different blood veils will make your attacks a little bit different there. Never stay in the outfits though that have, you know, the sleeves behind you. Kind of like they do have in Fire Emblem. It just that really drives me insane that you get the jacket on just over the shoulders there. How does that work in battle? I don't know. I'm gonna go back. Because that's that driving me nuts. Okay. Uh... It's too cramped. And easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. It'll actually take us to a big pot of nowhere. Alright, accumulating a good amount of haze, which we'll probably level up when we hit the next. Oh, didn't they pass us earlier? Are you okay? Did you get hurt? That could have gone better. I'll catch up with you in a bit. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'll be all right. Go on. Yeah, you I'm sure we'll be fine. Finding some blood beads, all right? That girl is waiting for you. Well, I guess I'll leave you to die then. Don't worry about me. I'll be all right. Go on. 
We got a chemical light. All right. A generic one. And you're down. Big boy. Okay, definitely use regeneration there. That was a mistake. That. Okay. That got a little dangerous. Let's go. Got a little bit of you as well. I'm more kind of a parry guy, more of a dodger myself. Right, let's see what we got over here, though. A little bit of a back area. We'll go check it out. I get to go the back attack on you. Maybe not. Nice. And you're down. I think that would just take us... Ooh, what do we have, though? Okay, so inventory capacity is somewhat limited. I do want to kind of explore this area back here, though. Oh, I'll turn to path. Okay, well, crap. And you are down. Little bit of stealthy. You're down as well. Now, is it worth it to get my butt murdered over here? I don't know. One on one, I wouldn't worry too much. Okay, but he definitely knows we're here. Too slow. Got that lost broadsword. Well, I see loot, I pick it up, it's what I do. And it. Noise. Right, so we've kind of come back from whence we came. That doesn't sound good, whatever that is. Dagger. Actually, did we miss anything over. Oh, I see loot over there, though. So this is like there's way more down as well. Yeah, it looks like both ways will go down. Okay, and we can't level up here. Alright, that is gonna respawn all enemies, though. Yeah, only if we rest, though. I think we should. Get a regen back. Um, but let's... 
level up. Let's get about level three. Let's see about some gifts as well. Continue with the fighter. Blood guard. That is passive for 560. While we're focused, all right. In the ability, it's probably proficient. You're gonna lock the ability, inherit it. All right, 560 as well. And we got blood guard, which is an active ability. Of yeah, we're out of. Okay, nice. Unfortunately, all the enemies have come back now. Kind of tempted to see where this is going to go. Oh, no, you are going towards the story, which I want to be going the opposite direction. What the heck are you? Uh, I'm going to regret this. I don't have a lot of space with this guy. Yeah. Got all right. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Um. Okay. Good job. Good job, me. All right. All right, Queen Slayer Thorn. So we got a different outfit. Let's try that out. Oh, how's the test effects? What's the other one? Uh, I still think I will go with. Yeah, looks a little bit sharper. I know stats do mean everything, but that one was a little too much uh, gaudy for me. And since we're already here and they're going to respawn anyway, let's might as well rest. I don't see any point in not. Are you a fellow explorer? It appears you're alone. I'm on my own at the moment, too. And I was hoping for a partner for the path ahead. What do you say? Would you mind working together? At least until we're through here? Don't worry, I'm not going to stab you in the back. My asthma and the lost here are enough trouble as it is. All right, let's go together. Safety in numbers. Now, where do I want to go that way? Uh, I'm going to go check out the other area first. It's good to be with you. Good to be with you, stranger. Or does that just come down? Yeah, I wonder if we can go the other way. That is quite a few. Which way is more tactical? Wanna head down? No. Oh god, do we have to head into that? It seems like it'd make more sense to avoid the whole thing entirely, but. That is not what the people are here for. Oh God! Run, oh, run! Okay, we got you. All right, good, good, good. Nobody else really noticed that. All right, fair enough. There's at least four of you in there, though. That's, uh... I'm a little worried. Let's power up now. Ah! Narnia! Alright, for Narnia. Jesus, okay. I'll worry about him. Easy two-shotter. 
I'll take credit for that. Is there a way to get him up on that? Otherwise, I could switch over my caster skill, but I think it'd be fine if I just go over here and murder the unholy crap out of you. Very nice. We mastered the gift known as the Blood Guard. Are we done? Yeah. Good gem mab out of us. Well. Not bad for a bit of derp in there. Make sure we don't miss any loot. Oh, letter up over here. Got it. I do believe there is another miasma before we reach uh, the exit. Another missile. Missile? Oh, words are tough. And that just leads right back down the other way. No, but that actually is. Oh god, we are already lost. Yep, until you get to your bases where the demo kind of leads off. But then it does give you optional areas, uh, dungeons to do. I think we can go up here. But. I would have sworn that is where we left. But no, there's another one. Ah, we found some blood beads. You can just drop down. It's not that far. Right, let's activate a blood spring. There's a part of the activate dried up blood springs, producing blood beads again. It says we only just the one. Could that really be? Well, I guess we're gonna have to split it. Go half seas. Right, well, I think this is a good spot, of course. Yeah, let's activate. Rest and recover our recharges as well. I think I do want to put some more into leveling. That's one more level up. All right, to level four. Hey, you. That's. Uh, forget it. We'll talk later. All right. Yeah, you can only save to get out of the game. Doesn't have a save anywhere option. We're not far from the surface now. Not so far, but he's dead. That's. Kind of good in our favor. What do we have here? Queen Slayer Blade. Well, actually, for what's coming up, I think I probably will switch. Just because it'll be a little faster. Getting attacked here would be seriously bad. It's There's something around here. Yep. I'm gonna let you handle that. Nice. Very good. You're also very dead. Something we can use? Yeah, we'll do some loot over here. 
I do have some uh, blood haze drops we could use as well. I forgot about those. I'll keep watch there. Yeah, we have two. It's a couple hundred. Whoa, okay, whoa. Oh god, whoa, ah. He's there, buddy. I said I did have to pop one, but. This lake was formed from a hole created by a thorn of judgment. Too bad I can't assassin drop on you. Nice to know the shard. Alright, we got a rotten missile. Uh, I think going down there, I really don't feel like that. Good. That's light from the surface. Yeah, I don't think we want to be here, though. Well, that's uh, Vinton up ahead. Someone is lost, they can never come back. Cast aside their doubt. All right, so we're coming across our first boss. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're not taking the boss fight again because unfortunately, I got a text message in the middle of that I had to stop in. Unfortunately, this game does not have pause. During a fight, so all right, I've got my haze. I'll get out all of our cars and get the guy. Get that. Get that. Get that. I'll just keep you distracted. Oh. He's gonna do transformation into the second. All right, that's where I kind of got hosed last time. Oh wait! Unfortunately, that gives him uh, my health though, which is dangerous in itself, especially when he's an idiot and gets himself. But I'm also an idiot. Oh god, run. Oh, then he can give me my life back. Also should have done the power up earlier. Easy for you to say. Nah. All right, very good. Be sure you save some regeneration. And nice. And juggernaut sledgehammer. Now that try did go a little better. By the way, both of you, 
All revenants must pay a levy. There are no exceptions. Must pick up shiny. Must pick up. Transformed into the lost. Don't listen to their whispers. Pick me up. Someone has to be sacrificed. Without blood beads, we won't make it. Once she's settled down, let's get out of here. Someone has to be sacrificed. Oh, I'm totally gonna pick that up. Screw it. Wait, what are you? Let go! It'll swallow you up! It's alright. You can do it. By the power of Grayskull! Now inside the memories of Oliver Collins. Please let us keep them just this once. We won't make it if you take them. All revenants must pay a levy of blood beads. There are no exceptions. Sorry. Silver's control. Wandering reverence like us, forced to hunt for blood beads, or face death. Even if some reverence must be sacrificed for our survival. Well, the last minutes of poor Oliver. This is a memory echo. It's a place where lost recollections still wander. Come, let's move on. If you use that stairway, I believe it should take us back to the world outside this memory. All right, fair enough. Is this the past of one of the lost? No, there's no way. All right, now I am out of here. Yeah, each of the lost shard S's are about worth a hundred hays. was a memory carved into that vestige by the one who left it behind I didn't expect that I'd get dragged into it too we both melted into you I can't oh, I don't even know you guys names either that's awkward come with me I know a spot where we can rest. I'm Louie. I'm researching blood beads. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I'm the silent protagonist, so... 
Good to meet you. All right, so we're to get Oliver Collins Berserker Core. So high class, high oh high strength and endurance. That's set with heavy armor. So it's another class. Ugly, isn't it? Yeah, I don't think it's too bad. The red mist showed up a short time after the queen was defeated. And when it did, it trapped everyone and everything inside, giving birth to the society of revenants ruled by Silva. The Jail of the Mists. As time passed, that was the name people gave to the world inside. The creatures trapped inside the miasma wander in a never-ending cycle of death and rebirth, always searching for blood beads to sustain them. Revenants need to have blood. Without it, they turn into those creatures we call the Lost. The Revenants who captured you were desperately searching for blood, terrified of losing themselves. It's a common fate these days. But ripples are beginning to form. You cleared the miasma and revitalized the blood spring. Where did you learn to do that? You've forgotten? <laughs> Anything you do remember? That's unusual. Losing so much of your memory. I suppose it was the same for her. For now, just take it easy. Make yourself at home. Alright, new home! Home base. Which I can't help but notice shiny stuff over here, so. Season pass. I did get the season pass as well. I did, which was really weird, I didn't question it. Like, uh, to figure the underground storage to have season pass accompany his partner. So we got a different alternate Mia as a partner. I think there is more. Pure bonus to Harbinger. Underground storage. And there's something else here. I don't know. Is that all Harbinger? Astria. From the underground storage, which is somewhere. Also, really weirdly, you can just lie down. You can watch yourself sleep. Yeah, it's alright. We have a whole bunch of oh, put down here, and that's another bedroom. We can't lay down in that one though. Okay, so this is in the basement. Probably any of your DLC stuff will be. Harbinger. So let's actually see. Is able to come in as partner? Okay, you are tiny. We'll try that one. See how it works out. But of course, you can actually adjust your appearance if you want any time when you're back at home base. You're an unfamiliar face. Has Louis stuck his head into another pot of trouble? Well, it's none of my business, really. Anyway, I'm Coco, a merchant by trade. Stop by if you need anything. Sorry, but I'm in the middle of... Yeah, that's that weird that they just stop talking the minute you wander off. Remember is that my name 
is Io, and that my place is by your side. My name... I have no idea what it means. I was wounded while I was searching for you. I am not a very capable fighter. I'm not sure. It was simply decided. One does what must be done. And for me, that is my mission. To stay at your side. Okay, fair enough. Also, music. Let's stop that for now. Let's return to the map. Take, talk to Luz to gather more info. Exploration goal. I'll check out the rest of the base. All revenants carry some secret with them. Don't do anything funny. I'll be keeping an eye on you until this talk with Louis settles down. Of course, the mouse, when the noun cut seems to never move, which is a little weird. But I can't sit here. And we can also just... Hey, look at me. That's what we do. Alright. Let's have a nice degree of character customization. Already have any other boombox here. Okay, you can actually have music from both sides because it'll start to uh, die out when you get about this far, so it's a little weird. There you are, the revenant that Louis sees so much potential in. I'm Davis. I go around for the provisional government as part of the investigation into the depths. Just as a warning, try not to stir up any trouble. If you. Oh, and then. What? And then? What? No? What do we got over here? Oh, just a training dummy that you can practice on. So let's look into this new class. Desperate birds. Do most over to the area around you, but leaves you on the brink of death. Um. So you already have that gift. What about you? Triple booster defense. Gives extension. Let's actually look at Berserker. Nothing really any too passive. Well, we've pretty much got they had learned for the most part. Well, maybe just work on leveling up then. All right, to level eight. Nice. All right, so let's go talk to Louie. The ability to draw strength from experiencing memories and the power to revitalize blood springs, both unprecedented. Sorry, but could I get a sample of your blood? We might understand more if we analyzed it. It won't be much, just a small vial, so you won't need to worry about blood thirst. It'll take a while to get the results. Take it easy in the room back there while you wait. All right, nap time. I will just uh, want to take a nap for a while. Sounds good. And if we're like almost kind of like vampires, I don't know why we need beds really. I don't think we're sleeping. Could be different kind of vampire though. A 
Let's see if that's done. I've done what I can to look into your talents. I've confirmed something surprising. Revenants have blood types that differ from those of humans. These types greatly affect a revenant's abilities. However, your blood has no specific type. Or maybe more accurately, your type is broken. Your abilities, and the fact that you have no specific type, might be due to your being what we call a void type. You were able to gain another revenant's power through a vestige, right? That phenomenon is unique to void types. Supposing you are a void type, there's a test I'd like to perform. Don't worry, you'll get something out of it. I'm going to give you some of my blood. If my theory is correct, it should act as a medium that will give my power to you. Well, here goes. All right, so we got Prometheus. Well balanced for combat, but fragile. Gets bolts of dodging and parrying. Ooh, could be good. Did you go visit Murasame and Coco? They should be ready to do business now. Weapons right. and blood veils are vital parts of a revenant's kit when exploring. You should take another look at them. If you've got materials, upgrade and transform them. Once you've got that settled, talk to me again, and we'll continue where we left off. All right. Sounds good. All right, Coco, what do we got? I've got just about anything you could want. Oh, because that's just, uh, we don't have any training points. So I need 10 for that. So that's stuff you'll trade me. Gotcha. Okay, let's if see. I got it. You're gonna cost haze though, right? Now you just spent all mine. Yeah, a bit unfortunately. Uses a marker. It's more kind of the multiplayer aspect, I would imagine. So you're just gonna sell side items. Come again soon. Got it. Do weapon and weapon upgrades. <gasps> Unfortunately, I spent all my. What do you want to upgrade? Yeah, I would like to do some upgrades, but we just spent all our money, or haze anyway. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna get a decent upgrade to our weapons for not too much, but yeah, I am. Which blood veil do you want to upgrade? Oh, that wouldn't be bad. Yeah, we need 600, though. Uh, maybe. Let's see. Oh, I am cheap. These might be gifts for uh, people here, so let's not. Okay. Let's just stay out that for now. You remember that scene we witnessed at the Vestige? That kind of stuff happens every day here. Silva has taken most of the humans who survived under his protection. So revenants are left to rely on blood beads alone to slake their unending thirst. But... Well... Nothing in this world lasts forever. The springs started to dry up, and so blood beads grew rarer and rarer. And the order Silva created by levying and distributing blood beads won't last much longer either. The world needs more blood beads. Only then can we strive for fairness instead of petty favoritism. That's why we've been exploring the Jail of the Mists. We're doing research to learn all we can about blood beads. But the miasma has been a real problem. 
It makes our thirst even worse, so our progress has stalled. Now, though, we have a glimmer of hope. Your power can clear the miasma. If you could help us... Well, you'd be drawn into a better conflict. Still, the truth is, we don't have a lot of hope without you. Uh, kind of put me on the spot there. Thanks. So, it's a done deal? <laughs> well then, from now on, you're one of us. Yakumo Shinanome. <laughs> I'll be looking forward to seeing you in action. Let's get right into it. Here's what's going on. We're studying blood beads and their springs. We want to know how and when blood springs appear, their cycles for producing beads, and the composition of the beads themselves. We've made a few discoveries. First of all, we found that there are tubes like capillaries running through the earth. We call them blood veins. And so far as we can determine, every single blood spring is located on top of one of these blood veins. Also, after comparing blood beads and blood veins, we now know that they are mostly comprised of the same substances. In other words, we can safely assume that blood springs always form along blood veins. And we think that means there must be a source somewhere, a kind of headwaters for the blood beads. Now that we have you around to clear the miasma, we can investigate the springs and follow the blood veins. And hopefully, find the source. Right? We want to check out the old city ruins first. Sorry for the rush, but we should head out as soon as you're ready. Moving from missile to missile. As long as they're active, it's so kind of a teleporter. Gotcha. Well, I feel like we're inadequately prepared. So, alright, let's go. Use your partner while you explore and heal with restorative offerings. Got it. I got no presents. All right. No, I must have talked to the. Uh, where do we head out? Nope. Fair enough. Let's see what Louis wants to send us. Something up. We can head out whenever you're ready. Is something up? Don't forget anything. Is something up? It's up to you now. Okay, so that was the partner thing, and uh, oh, I gotta go grab. Personalizing her appearance. Gotcha. Fortunately, I think we have to go down here anytime we want to do partner with her. Alright. Nice. Maybe on the map. Store deficient gifts for the blood codes. Okay. It seems I can restore the blood code of a vestige's creator from elements left in the vestige. If you find any vestiges, please let me know. It could be a chance to grant you additional strength. I'm all for that. Is something up? 
we'll need to find three blood springs in our search for the source. Springs are always found in locations with missile. So, first we find missile, then expand our search radius from there. We can head out whenever. But just don't know where we're going. There you are, the revenant. Yeah, you said the same thing. The way not there. Well, there's only really two choices. Oh, actually, here we go. At our crossroads, I feel like that might be it. Let's teleport out there. So the world that you've explored. Okay, nice. Alright, so we've got Mia. Oh, you're exploring this area too? I'm a merchant of sorts. I wander around selling valuables as I explore. The miasma has gotten pretty thin here lately, eh? I thought it might be dangerous, but came all the same. I haven't seen a fellow explorer for a while, though. I think we were fated to meet. Take this map of the depths. I'll be around here for a while. If you want to buy anything, let me know. Don't hesitate to... Access in the depths. So I feel like this is kind of going back to whence we came. We'll put that to good use. Let's see. Um, well, I don't feel like we do have. Maybe we don't know this area. I want to say semi-familiar though. That's good, I was worried. A map of the depths. You should show it to Davis. Okay, so found another map. Go exploring. Okay, it's actually quite expansive. So it goes back up, but I'm kind of, uh, no, that's where we're going. Alright, fair enough. Okay, so we did find... So it should lead us to another source. Expectations exceeded. That settles it. You are absolutely vital to our operation. There are more blood springs ahead, but the miasma is blocking the way forward. Do you think you could clear it for us again? Thank you. We know where two springs are thanks to past expeditions. Let's go have a look at them. The territory up ahead is teeming with the lost. Watch yourself. I really, eh, no point in running. Area 13. Lost shard medium. Let's actually. I understand wanting to be cautious, but. Get a little bit. The path has opened up. 
Conversion of partner exchange for greater power they grant. Extract price from the users. Okay. We got loot over here. And actually, I might want to try... Just for funsies. Well, actually, we'll switch back over to Warrior, maybe. That should give us the stats for that. Oh, yeah, there we go. It's more Queen Iron. This place is huge. Hard to believe there's nobody left. All right, loot up this way. I think we actually just found a vestige. Huh? Is that really? Part A. Okay. Oh, it just like we got a little bit of trouble coming up. Too many places to hide. I've got a bad feeling. Oh well. Nice. Okay, my new favorite weapon ever. Use every tool you have, right? Anything else there? Very nice. Very nice. By the way, gentlemen, I think I will leave off here. So far, overall first impressions, a little bit beyond. Not too much farther than the demo did. But playing again through the initial part. Character customization is nice. There is clipping. Uh, sometimes, yeah, their mouths don't move when they're not in uh, the cutscenes, but overall, yeah, enjoyable. Combat feels good. Story feels good. I uh, would recommend. Season Pass, I don't know if it's going it's to be worth it. We'll have to see what else they have planned, but but really, pre-order bonuses, other stuff, nothing really insanely exciting. Probably, gentlemen, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you want more Code Vein in the comments. And I will see you guys next time.